Alright guys, so this is Delmon for Mushroom Fleet, and we are here with Zyrenica taking a look at his ZIS Zinnia, and we've got uh, Ghost here as well for some guest commentary, uh, and uh, Hello. hopefully you'll be hearing a lot more of my voice lately. Uh, I'm going to start doing some of the uh, reviews that have been backlogged here for Mushroom Fleet. So, without any further ado, Zy, tell us a little bit about the ship. All right, uh, hello, I'm Zyrenica. This is a full-size meat carrier. There's 12 fighters internally and two separate hangar bays. Uh, vertical hangar bay design. The, the main armament is 48 BB missile arrays uh, in the outer wings and 44 B-1000s alongside the hangar internally. And let's go inside and take a look. Yeah, that is a heck of a lot of firepower. So where is the uh, the door on this baby? I know there's the hangar doors, but where's the uh, little door? Or do we just go into hangar? There's hangar doors on the back, on the front, and then there's two small entrance doors for shuttles and such on the sides in the middle. Right, I, like, the I like the idea of the little doors. So we'll head down there. I think I'm on the Your right side of the ship. Might fit into it. Let me just, before I go inside, let me just fly over to these turrets here real quick. They are really packed full of detail, dude. You did a really nice job on these. And they look like they have some serious Thank firepower you. as well. Oh yeah, with the next patch, uh, or with the weapon update, they're going to be completely revamped into game warfare. Massive laser turrets. And then another one of my favorite features on this thing are these little... Uh, Apartments on the side that look like they're just kind of opening up into some sort of internal labyrinth. Yep. Alright, so I'm head over to the right side of the ship. And we will take a look inside. I think my ship got away from me. Straight note, you might actually have to put inside. <laughs> it's not a open back door for you. Alright, you know what? Let's see if I do. That'll be cool. It's gonna be close. Well, yeah, it's easy to Oh. Perfect size. <laughs> <laughs> How about that? Not much space in here. No, definitely very cramped, but you have a lot of fighters inside here. Wow. Yeah, just enough room for the fighters to maneuver. That's it. Are we moving? Or am I moving? Are you moving? Yeah, this, uh, <laughs> shroom copter likes to get away from people. Alright, so. <laughs> Where, where are we heading? It's a pretty impressive view from in here as well. I love looking up and seeing this big cavernous space. All the little fighters hanging One out. One moment to not come join you. I'm guessing it's this little blue airlock thing. Aha! Mm -hmm. Hello. Okay. Well, back here is a, is a small shuttle bay. We hold six. We hold six shuttles. Whoa. Okay. Is it out of either side? Oh, that's really cool. Oops. So you kind of have like a central like... hangar for your shuttles. That's pretty awesome. I like how uh, when it's dark and you have a hangar inside. Actually, let me go grab one of my shuttles and I'll show you what I mean. looks around this massive room. I love the detail on the hangar doors too. That's something that people need to do I think more often. Yeah, shit seems you're moving. No, you're not moving at all. 
Can, can I be let in? Yep. The side door is open. Yep. I'm on the right the side here. Spawned. Getting some up close and personal shots of the detail here. Whoa, okay. That definitely fits. Kind of, <laughs> maybe. Maybe. If you come back out and go in straight, you should fit. Oh no, no, nope. the top and bottom wings are too big. I bet you it'll fit through the back hanger though. Yeah, I'll open that up. Actually, the far side one is almost open already. Over there. And I'll be right there. There it is. Right there. Yeah, my client just crashed again, hold on. Oh, no problem. When you get back on, I'll go ahead and start taking a look around inside. Really, really a fan of this today. hallway here. Massive open space. Not really that big in comparison to the entire ship. <laughs> the width of that entire central area is only like seven blocks. Or nine blocks, something like that. Not very much. Alright, so I'm gonna go upstairs first. Or no, we should go downstairs. Upstairs. Upstairs? Okay. Right upstairs. Upstairs has uh, the bridge. Nice detail on the inside. I really like how you have the docking enhancers actually coming through the ship instead of just trying to hide them away. Honestly, that was because I didn't have much choice. <laughs> yeah. You made it work. Well, this seems a little bit familiar. Okay, got the shuttle in here. Also looks very sinister up here. It does. Very command-like. Bit of a sense of urgency. Ooh, and blast doors! We have blast right, when we get back to when we get back to the shuttle bay, you will see what I meant about the shuttles when they're gone. If you hop into the core, could you open these uh, blast doors for us? Oh, uh, actually, I'm I'm heading up there anyway, so I'm just opening them myself. All right, fantastic. In the meantime, I will sit in one of these cleverly placed here. I like the tiered layout you have here for the bridge. Yeah. Ooh, I'm getting ideas. <laughs> Wait a minute. I like that you guys are wearing the same skin. <laughs> We're close. Doppelgangers. I was going to put consoles on these two, on these stands on either side of the captain's table, but I uh, couldn't figure out a way to block the other side. Oh, 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 look at this. That is a view. Straight down the middle of the ship. Very interesting yeah. way to have a centralized interior on this. I do like it a lot, and wait until uh, shadows come become involved. Oh yes, we've already done a little bit of preliminary uh, oh, wow, experimentation. Yeah. Honestly, I'm, gonna... I'm I still surprise myself in how much I was able to pack into this small width area. Ah, I'm impressed by it. It's very, very nice. I love the Down glass walkway level, as well. This is the core. It's hard to tell which one of you is which one I'm not in tab G like this. There's actually four doors that close along here. Oh wow. Extra reinforcement. The core is right here. The core is protected in front and bottom sides by somewhere like ten layers of hardened hull, even though it doesn't look like it. No, yeah, I've never heck of a reinforcement. Yeah. I've never actually seen the skin I'm wearing up close. Take there are factions off if you want to take a look at Whoa, red messages. Okay. Oh, Alright, so we're going to go into building mode here. We are looking at everything. a massive 68,000. Uh, 370 meters long, 131 meters high, 307 meters wide with it looks like... Is that 22 or 2.2 million power storage? Uh, more than that. 
two hundred and something million power stores. Okay, um, that's pretty Are impressive. Two hundred and sixty-four million. Two hundred and sixty-four million power stores. Okay, and then three point one six three million e second regions is definitely not hurting for power and really, really snapping on the uh, acceleration too, from the looks of things. Honestly, it takes all of that power just to move the ship. Whoa. Sorry, I had to try and move the ship. Which, in <laughs> hindsight, there was goes. probably a horrible idea. There goes my loose shuttle. Oh well, I'll get it later. Alright, so primary weapons are missiles. 48 BBs in one array, 44 D1000s in one array, and eight, no, sorry, four more BBs in a secondary array. All right, so let us take a shot here. <laughs> I believe that the missiles have just given up on life. They do when you fire all 96 at once. Yep, they've given up. Oh, and I didn't take a look at the shield. We got 2.5 million shield. Not bad at all, especially considering the uh, nature of the beast being a carrier and all. Lots of thin lines on it, uh, thin areas, lots of negative space. You'd be surprised, right. actually, how much hollow space there was inside this ship. Well, I'll close the blast doors as you exit and show you what it is. And one more floor down is the conference room. Seems like every ship's going to be equipped with a conference room from now on. <laughs> it's necessary. In the future, when we have our uh, sit-down conferences, we'll uh, be touring ship to ship. Yeah. Are these connected to the yeah, upstairs blast doors, or are these completely door? separate? Uh, no, this is a separate blast door system. Very nice I can view. still see all the missiles just floating out there. Angry, angsty <laughs> missiles. It's a spectacular. This is actually a solid wall of flex glass right behind, in front of here. Oh wow! So definitely not hurting for reinforcement as well. I love all the different types of flowers. I tend to be with my build. I tend to be pretty lazy and usually use just one type <laughs> or something like that. Maybe I managed with only four types here. I was actually pretty lazy testing it all in those. Further down are the uh, quarters. Or, sorry, actually, first is the captain quarter. In kind of a half half deck. Oh, very nice. Got the luxury very. edition bed. What could be conceived or contrived as a TV of some sort. And your very own strange plant bio garden. Outstanding. With the X on the door, of course. Oh, indeed. And you'll notice a lot of the walls will have this symbol on it, or a variation of it. Actually, if we go back up to the main corridor for a second. Oh, isn't there more downstairs? Yep, yeah, there is. Uh, well, there's no more here. But in the middle of the main corridor is a couple of the, a bunch of those activities. Further down is the actual crew quarters with windows on either side looking out into the hangar. I love this view. And each of the quarters are identical. But... Not skimping any on the crew beds. see their comrades coming back in as they <laughs> sleep. So each of these quarters is identical and there's uh, five of them. Alright, so 
what do we have up here? Up here is the back stairway down from the main corridor, as well as the pathway leading to engineering. Very nice use of asymmetry here. And engineering. More ships need some engineering. Or things that involve engineering happen. Oh, are these levels accessible by the different uh, hallways? Right here. I'm not sure. I think I've lost you. Uh -huh. Back here is the stairway. Moves up to the center. And then back here is another stairway. That leads all the way up to the top. Oh, wow. And then there's one more stairway down to the last level. What's this little uh, miniature door up here? Uh, access crawlways. Ooh, Jeffrey's tears. Just to the power and power storage. Just thought it would look nice. And here's the main docking modules for some of the other turrets. Shuttle bay with a shuttle actually in it. Alright, let's go check let's that go out. Check and this is the reason why I left it dark. Oh, that's, cool. that's cool. Although, to be honest, with shadows, this must be very interesting. Zad, thank you very much for uh, bringing the Zinni out here to uh, show us. And as always, thanks for watching.